you don't necessarily um, deal with. He like can that be in Primark. You can be. Everyone has a Primark tea. All mm. the guys have a Primark tea in there. Whether he's got your... Primark crepes on. <laughs> Yeah, no, listen, some of them must be one of no, them. No, no. Kind of like no. Air Forces. I said, Eight pound, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Big man thing, yeah? It's Castillo, aka the brand, aka that's tough, out now on all digital platforms, bruv. Welcome to Cuffin Season. Now, you already know what it is, bruv. Now, Cuffin Season, yeah? We pair artists and personalities with the choice of free mystery dates, bruv. The only thing they're going to know about them. Yeah, is their playlist, bruv, yeah? Bruv, I'm telling you, nobody does it like this, bruv. Big man ting, keep locked in cuffing season, bruv. Shout out to your baby mum. Big man ting, you know she's watching. Come on. Big man ting, I'm here. Lippy. Family on, tree. What are you saying, my Come bro, on, my brother. You're looking good, bruv. You're looking good. <laughs> Thank That's... you, my brother. Yeah. Now, real talk, you already know what this is, yeah? So, I know what this is, man. Cuffing season, yeah? Yeah. So, what are you expecting, bruv? I don't know, man. That's the that's the beauty of these things. You understand? I mm. go by the the playlist and them thing there, and then mm. I see where it goes from there. You get me? So I gotta say this though, like your status is elevating on a mad thing, it's yeah. So yeah. yeah, have you noticed the big difference between Gallim approaching you now, yeah, compared to before? And what's the difference? You know, what it is the main thing is a lot of gal that I chat to, they already know who I am before mm. I chat to them. You feel me? So sometimes when it comes to like. Know that awkward break in the ice. There's a lot of things I don't have to explain. Like, do you think that now, yeah, a lot of gal are on a money thing now? Don't get it twisted. I think like gal always like money, man. That's always gonna be a thing. But I think the reason they like money, man, is because of their status. Mm. And you can have status without the money. You understand, like. I've always been a popular guy. I'm sure there's a lot of men that can relate. You understand. Course, so when it course. comes to things like social media, like popularity and them thing there. A lot of man was already like preparing for this their whole lives, like subliminally, you feel me? Mm. So now man's here, man kind of just manoeuvre. So you think some way. man are already mastered the gal man, Listen, certain man got no peas, bro. <laughs> Bitter gal. Certain <laughs> man's got no you all beer, picnic, tree, picnic, no income. How? I know how. So now you already know, yeah. Yeah. This is cuffing season, so we're gonna it's get that season, we're gonna bro. go through it, yeah. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get to some playlists, yeah. So free oh, playlists, free, and you tell yeah. me which one you're gonna choose, and that's the gal you're gonna get, bruv. So the yeah. first one. Uh huh. I'm gonna tell you some tunes as well. First playlist got a track, Jugging by Rimsey. Mhm. Mm Raw. Can't be us, Heady One. Mhm. And then finally on that playlist, Elegant and Gang, D Block Europe. What do you think of that playlist? See, this girl's on the roads. <laughs> she can't, don't bring her in here. So now, this is the second playlist, yeah? Yeah. So, what we got here is Unavailable, DeVito. Okay. Me and You, Central C. Oh, all right then, it's just it's a little bit more subtle though. And then what we got finally on that one is Live, Band OK. Yeah, I went left. <laughs> she went left, the last tune. <laughs> she went jail as well, this girl. Big man ting, so. I don't know. So now this is the third place. You ain't got to ah, make the cool. decision yeah, yet. So this yeah. is the third one, the third one, man. This is LMA. Okay. Karma, Summer Walker. Oh, okay. Worth It by Ray. Oh, this she's come, bring her in there, man. Big, so, so you made your decision? I made my decision. Yeah, so that's, that's playlist C. So we're no going to playlist C. Tune. There, get every tune, girl. All right, yeah, yeah. Man, that's what that's So with the beautiful lady of playlist C, please come out, man. Hello. Right. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm all good. What's your name? Jay. I'm Lippy. Big man Tim. So you already introduced yourself. So <laughs> yeah. Jane, meet Lippy. Lippy, meet Jane. Right. Nice to meet you. So, nice to meet you. Before we get into this, what's your lot's first impression so far? Decent. I just want to know a bit more, to be honest. Lippy, your first impression? She's not, she's not playing. Jane ain't playing. I feel like... It's taking your breath away right yeah, there, bruv. I'm recovering. Come on, come on. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to get out the way, bruv, and let the yeah. magic flow, bruv, yeah? yeah? Flow, man. And big man ting, shout out to the sponsors. They're going to be coming out with some beautiful food, bruv. Mama's blessings, bruv. So make sure you lot check them out. Big man ting, right. I'm going to go over there. You lot enjoy the date, bruv. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. What was your first impression of Jane when she walked out? She's not playing. She's like a, she's not like a plane. She's like a fighter jet. But yeah, no, nah, very, very good looking woman 
Hello, Jane. Hi. You all right? Yeah? I'm good. How you doing? I'm very good, mm -hmm. man. You seem good. <laughs> yeah, you seem good. <laughs> you seem good. What was your first impressions when you saw Lippy? Um, just a decent guy. He wasn't like, he wasn't like, overdressed or anything, but just casual. And so what are you saying now? When's the last time you was in a relationship then? I would say like pre-COVID. Pre-COVID? Yeah. Yeah. Pre it has, it Thank has. Thank you. That looks good. That looks <laughs> decent, Ross, yeah. You know. So you saw a lockdown and you thought yeah, just freedom. Needed, I thought freedom. I didn't want to come out of lockdown and be in lockdown. So Ooh, I, like that. I just, I wanted to be a little bit. So what country are you from, Jane? Heritage. I like Do you want to guess? I want to guess. Mm -hmm. Is it Nigerian? Yeah. Big Ooh. man team. <laughs> Shout out to Nigeria. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Definitely. Really? Mm. Where's your partner from, if you don't mind me asking? Nigerian as well. Oh, it's Nigerian? Mm -hmm. Okay. They then. always are. They always are? <laughs> oh, so you, most, most, most your boyfriend them being from Nigeria? Um, right? Yeah, most of them. What did you feel when she said all her ex-boyfriends have been Nigerian? I felt my wallet vibrating. And my wallet ain't even a phone. My wallet phoned, man. What yeah. about what about you? Caribbean or Caribbean or West African? I see that. Couple North African. Obviously, I think I should just put this out there. It's right that we're getting to know each other and that. Mm -hmm. like, from previous relationships, that like, I have, I have children. I'm a, I'm a father. Okay. Honesty, oh, Bev. You gotta read the honesty, Bev. Yeah, I just thought I'd, yeah. I'd let that be known. Do you have like more than one, or do you have? Yeah, I got, like I got, I got more than one. Okay, so you just spread it out the seeds, and then I'm not spreading out the <laughs> seeds. I just think, <laughs> I just think the Lord, <laughs> when a child has to be born, mm. the Lord is gonna bring that you, like mm. the you, yeah. But okay. Yeah, I have, I have five children. Five. I have Big man, thing. Lippy putting in work, Bev. Your no. children? That's interesting. No. Do you regret telling her that you had five kids? Nah, man, I don't. I don't. I put that out there from now. I'm a very hands-on dad, innit? So whether I let women know how much kids I got or not, within a couple of days of knowing, man, you're going to hear some children in the background. Man's going to link you. It's all... Man's got milk vomit on my shoulder right now. What happened? Do you do, like, the dating thing? Do you kind of, like put yourself out there to see mm, what's... No, I haven't been putting myself out there. I haven't? I'm just, no. More time people come to me, but Sugar it's just daddies, left for me if Sugar I daddies. want to entertain it or not. But like, from time to time, you like to dabble in a little mm. date to see what's, what's going on. Yeah, but I'd rather, I'd rather deal with one person at a time. Mm. So if I start dealing with too many, I start confusing informations and stuff like that. Oh, well, yeah. I like to do a one. Can't be cross contaminating ways, like bro. You get me? You gotta stick that's, with one. Yeah, that's what's up. Bro. So say you had mm -hmm. two or three options at the moment, like right. what what would the guy that would be in the lead, like what would the, what that's would a that good kind question, of man bro. be? Okay. Okay. So the one there, that question. would be in the lead, mm. probably probably like pay me the most attention. Mm -hmm. I love a guy that kind of remembers things and just little small gestures. Doesn't have to be like spend big bags and stuff. That's good to know, man. I think it's there's a lot of mm. a lot of materialistic sisters out here. I didn't say I wasn't materialistic. Oh, oh. <laughs> but so you're you're, you're materialistic. No, I'm like, like, <laughs> I'm, I like a, a bit of both. Like, like a bit balance. of both. Balance, yeah. So let's just say <laughs> he can make you laugh. Right. He's, he, he remembers everything. Right. But he's wearing all, he's in all umbro right now. Mm. Okay. But the umbro's clean though, all white, <laughs> all white umbro. Like, what's, what's going on? You're not, you're not feeling it. <laughs> that's Shout not a question. Umbro, that's not a serious question. All right, Reebok, Reebok. <laughs> all Reebok. You don't necessarily um, deal with he that, can that, be that Primark. Clothing. He can be, everyone has a Primark tee. All mm. the guys have a Primark tee in there. Well, if he's got Primark crepes on. <laughs> Yeah, I no, listen, some of them, I see one of no, them, they no, look kind of like no. Air Forces, I said. Eight pounds, you can't go wrong, you can't go wrong. So what is it that you would usually look for? It has to be clean cut, that's just it really. Doesn't really matter about the labels, but clean cut. If I was in the Prime mm. Forces, mm -hmm. I, the, the date's over. 
Papers. Oh my days. <laughs> the prime air force. You know what? Fair enough. <laughs> exactly. That's, it's understandable. Exactly. I'm not going to act like... Men's Primark and women's Primark are two different kind of Primarks. That's why it's not fair though. <laughs> I could be dressed in all Primark and you wouldn't even be able to tell. Don't you think that's double standards though, a little bit? Nah. Life, I'm sorry. Oh, they don't care, bro. <laughs> they don't care. They don't, boy. You also mentioned during the date about the man them that are wearing the Primark forces. Yeah. Could you tell us more about Primark forces? Primark also done a collaboration with Greg's recently. <laughs> and that's... Nah, but I think I, I, I think I could... Nah, do you think I'm joking? Like, I, I'm so confident in myself that I think if I came through with the pastry drip, I'm killing it. Maybe not Jane. Jane's a bit <laughs> upper echelon for them kind of thing there. But when it comes to, yo, I'll put on a Greg's, a Air Greg's. Yo, big man yo. ting, I'm back, bruv. What's going on, my brother? How is the date going? How's everything going? Talk to me, talk it's to all me. Right, man. Man, it's all right, we're just, right, we're just getting to know and, yeah, man. one another. Going, I see you guys kind of share a nice little connection, West Africa, man. Big up West Africa, man. Mm -hmm. Shout out to the motherland, motherland, you get me? So, you're in a relationship. Uh huh. Chris Breezy comes to town. And he's yeah. come in there, six foot three of all light skinned man with a nose <laughs> yeah. ring and that, I cock locking and yeah. that. I know that. You answer. get me all of them things there, them sexy yeah. flexy I know, moves. I know where this you is get going. Me? He ain't been to Europe in a while. I man. know where this is going. Get me, so the Narnies are moist, bruv. The they're Narnies everywhere. are marinating. <laughs> bruv, you already know. Been, <gasps> they've yeah, been marinating. Yeah, they've been marinating. So, yeah. Chris Breezy comes to town. Yeah. Goes on stage. Yep, I know where this He starts is going. doing the little body lock, you know, them things there. That, yep. that thing there no. that he does, the take you down thing, no. bruv. Yeah, he starts doing them things there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then he looks at your girl in the audience. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then he's like, hey, hey, girl. Hey, girl. Brings yeah. her to the stage, and your girl goes up there, bruv. Then the next morning, yeah, you wake up. And it's on the shade, bro, bro. It's on I'll the be shade. honest, next. <laughs> what are you doing? I tell you the truth, man. man it, brother, from she makes that run, that's offside, bro. Mm. From you go to that offside, the stage is offside. From you've gone over there, the line up, bro, I'm gone, man. Big man. VAR. Too. Bro, I'm nah, nah. So, no. I'm gonna ask you a question now. Mm. Yeah? Yeah. Chris Breezy. I'm going. Big man thing. Okay. <laughs> okay. So you're, you're going to the stage. I'm going to the stage. Okay. <laughs> the sweat all over the face. Everything. In the conversation, mm. you mentioned if Chris Brown came to the yeah. UK, <laughs> you would be gone. I'm going. <laughs> but it's, it's the truth. And anyone that says no is lying. I'll go ask you this though. Mm. Yeah? Lippy. Yeah. Do you suck toes? No. Say no more, no. Say you no know where it is, bro. I tell a man straight. As man's got older, the foot's looking better to man. Because I was one of them, man, when teen years and that, she can't even take her sock off them day there. Mertie. Unless I'm in love with her. You understand? But now, I'm starting to see the feminine foot. Man's on it. There's levels to this foot thing, bro. Car. The foot could look good, but you don't know what run she's been making, bro. Mm. She might be a winger. Big man. She team. takes her shoes off in the gaff. It's, it's a it could go team. left, man. So yeah, man can't, man can't, it's not a suck. So it's a no team. to the foot. Nah. So I gotta ask you, do you suck toes? No. You know there's a lot of gal out here that's, that's sucking toes and eating Barty, I'm just saying. <laughs> They eating it like groceries. Yalem, 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 yalem eating groceries. Big man thing, I'm eating groceries. I don't eat groceries. You don't eat groceries? I don't suck toes either. So big man thing, we've come to that point where you need to make a decision. Yeah, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna give you this piece of paper Thanks. with a pen. Lippy, one for you or so, with mm -hmm. the pen. And what you need to do, you can't show each other this yet. What you need to do, you need to write down lovers or friends and hold it to yourselves. Okay. When you're done, what I want you lot to do is hold it up to the camera. Let them see what your decision is. Big man ting. And on three, you're gonna show it to each other. One, two, three. Okay, Boom, yeah. friends. Oh, oh, scheme. It's one of them ones, okay. One of them ones. So I gotta ask you, so first, Lippy, why did you yeah. make that decision to put friends? I'll be honest, bro, if there was, I wanted to pick Usher, lovers and friends, mm. but that weren't available. But I'll be honest, earlier on in the thing, obviously I explained that I had, I got humans on this planet that belong to me. I Big got children. Thing. And she said she's not really into the bare picnic thing. So I thought, you know what, common sense. 
okay. that the ship has sailed, you understand? Big man thing. So why did you decide to choose Friends? I think he was on the right, um, the right path with the, the humans. Yeah. So, Five aside team, man. We've well, got five, is, five is a lot. We've got, we've <laughs> the car is full already. We've got so a match tonight. There's no space for me in the yes. car already. Yeah. 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 Big man thing. So, <laughs> so yeah. it's a just eating food and yamming food and that's space. it thing. Yeah, big man thing, but bruv, sometimes that's just how it goes, bruv. Mm. You gotta get me real, and you got to be honest. Bro. I rate you yeah. lot for the honesty, mm. Mm -hmm. and I appreciate that, bruv. So big man thing, shout out to Mama's Blessing. You get me, bruv? Big man thing, this is cuffing season, bruv. Yeah. Done now. So I see at some point in the conversation, he mentioned about having five kids. So what was your first thought when you heard that? Curtains. Like, it was just curtains from, from that point. Ideally, mm -hmm. what kind of man are you looking for? I want a busy guy that hasn't got time for like all this extra stuff. Someone has had the lifestyle and is tired of it. Like we can both settle down together and build. Lippy, my boss. I will ask you, how did you find your date? Weren't really date vibes, you feel me, bro? It was a nice little vibe, nice little conversation. But she needs to know there's a couple umbro pieces. No, seriously, there's a couple umbro pieces that could that could cut through. And I'm gonna show them. I'm gonna show them this summer. Umbro. We could go. Trust Collab teams. Yeah, no, trust me.